Ready with me while I tell you guys some dating advice that has helped me get every single guy I've ever wanted. And let me tell you something, when I was in high school, I was not cute. I don't wanna hear that it's cause I'm cute because I was not, I promise. Also I splurged today and I'm really excited. I finally got the bronze drops that everyone's been talking about. So I'm gonna use them today. First thing is you 100% decide how someone treats you. With that being said, you wanna be treated like a queen? Act like a queen. You set the standards for the relationship in general. So if they don't meet those standards, leave them. <laughs> Second thing is being independent and not needing their company but wanting their company. There's a big difference between someone being a part of your life and someone being your entire life. I feel like if you act like someone's your entire life, that person loses a little bit of respect for you because you need to have other things going on. I know it sounds bad, but that's just what I've seen to be true. Another crucial thing is giving out the energy like you are the baddest bitch out there. And it's okay if you have some self-doubt, everyone does, but the more you keep telling yourself you're the baddest bitch out there, the more you're gonna start to believe it. Because it's really hard to disrespect someone who respects himself. Also, confidence is just a very attractive energy. So not only will you attract more people by being confident, but you will love yourself a little bit more. Now this next one is arguably the most important thing you can do. And it is never be afraid to leave them. They need to know that if they cheat on you, if they treat you wrong or do you wrong in any way, they're not getting a second chance. Now I'm not saying that you can prevent someone from cheating on you or that people don't get cheated on if they respect themselves and their boyfriends know that because that does happen. But I feel like it gives the guy a little bit more respect knowing that you respect yourself. And I think the biggest mistake that girls make is getting back together with their boyfriend after they cheat on them. Like, he's not gonna change. He's probably actually gonna cheat on you five more times because now he knows that it's okay and that there really aren't any consequences. Don't even get me started on how men fall in love biologically because it's actually crazy. But um, these are the things that I've just realized have helped me. And yeah, I wanted to share with you guys.